Hello, welcome back to our channel VTNGT Vlogs. Today in this video, I am going to talk about sun tint, all the sun films that we apply on our cars. And I would say that this uh, depends depending upon the regional transport office at your place and what are their rules. If you if they allow you to put on the sun glare films or not, it depends upon them. So I suggest you refer that and then put on this. I am just going to talk about what is the difference and why, why films and what is the difference that they cause uh, when you apply it on your car. So here I'm not going to, I'm like, this is not a sponsored video. So I'm not going to name the brand as such, which I have applied on the front screen and on the white side screens of, of this, my Skoda Rapid. So just to start with, I'll show you the difference between the two different films that I have. One at the front, it has more of the uh, sun, uh, like heat uh, reduction in it. And the another one to the side, it is it is less, it has less heat re uh, reduction as compared to the front one. So if we open the window, look from the outside, this is the outside view. When I get in, it has a bit of green tint in it at the front when I get back out and get on to this this has a brown tint in it so like if you compare it like that so what is the difference between these two films so this this I'll just tell you this the, at the front is a CR90 I won't take the brand and this at the side is a CR70 so as per company's details that I have referred the CR91 has most of like infrared re infrared rejection of 90% and CR70 has 97% of it as this is the front one is much clearer like it doesn't have that much of glare or uh, 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 what we can say is say it, it is not that dark this one is a bit dark but that is not that dark that uh, you will find that people are, you if you try to peep in from outside you won't find the people you won't get to see the people inside it but when we see it the glare reduction the front one has 3% and this side one has 22% of glare rejection and both the films have 99% of UV rejection so when we talk about glare what is glare is the look through capability of the film so when I get out of the car and I show you this film that is there if you get to see it it has a bit of glare on it so it reflects your the light towards you to uh, back towards you but when we go towards the front uh, it is the sky that is coming up but this has less of glare compared to the one that is on the windows if i go from the inside view you get to see that it's a look through film it doesn't have that much of darkness it's very less dark but it has a very good heat reduction and at the front, the film that is there at the front, it is the best. It has the best of heat reduction, if I say it. If we look at from this side, see, there is not much that you can like, you won't find any difference that if there is a film or not, but it saves lots of money in a longer run saying that your AC, AC gets effective and there is no much heat inside when you put your car in sun and it is a look through see I, when i'm looking it from the window towards the front from the front screen i can see i can look through these are not the dark films these are very faint films and has most heat reduction see when i'm looking through from the back i can see towards the front like it is look through but it has a very good heat reduction. I'll give you a walk around of this car so that you get the feel how the car looks. It looks premium with this sun glares that I have applied on it. The back seats has that mesh on it which Skoda has and you get to see it looks premium. It has a very good nice, nice look with that. If you like the video or have any question just post it on the comment section like the video thank you